that you need to have the characters that inhabit this mansion need to have also a painterly beauty to them. And the great thing now is because Guillermo provided me with a backstory, uh, when I make choices on set, he sees why I'm making a choice because he knows Lucille's history. Y es algo muy parecido a un cuento de hadas en cierta forma. Es una historia que tú has visto en Jenner, Cumbres Borrascosas. It's very, very foreboding. It's not somewhere you'd like to be trapped. I don't know whether it's just the feeling, because the set is kind of degenerated even more, but it felt quite dark in there. The first time we see Edith and her little outfit, it's this modern girl's suit, that we call that the buffalo bookworm. As I said to the world of designer, we're gonna build the costumes and we're gonna couture the architecture. This is the biggest and most extraordinary set I have ever seen in my entire life. We will make the movements of these uh, corpses very, very much stylized like a dancer. It's gothic romance, and those are terms that have been controversial and striking ever since the late 18th century. Del Toro understands this and is able to move effortlessly between the two genres. 